My name is Cecilia, and I'm the oldest sister of three sisters who have this channel. Uh, we really pretty much just do dorm tours on here, and this is, I think, the 10th dorm tour slash room tour that we have on this channel. Um, but I am studying in Chengdu, China for a semester. Um, as, I guess, part of my degree, I'm, I majored in electrical engineering, and this is just sort of a fun semester. Um, so I'm taking random classes and learning Chinese for the first time. Um, but I live in an international dorm on campus. Uh, it's way bougier than typical Chinese dorms are. I think typically there'd be like five or six Chinese people in one room like this. So I'm really lucky to have such a bougie dorm. I definitely don't feel like putting a lot of effort into editing this, so I'm just gonna do one of those videos where you grab the camera and walk around. Um, but hopefully you enjoy. I do. This is the view when you walk in. We've got a closet on the right. Some of the closets here are half this size. Some of them are bigger, but plenty of room. They give you these TVs for free. I hated how it looked in my room, so I just threw it in here. Yep. And then there's a cabinet up above, which is where I have my suitcase and my curtains, because I have curtains down. And then there's a drawer down here, which has some wrappers. Then on the left is the bathroom. The shower is actually part of the bathroom, which is kind of interesting. Um, I kind of like it, but at first it was weird. And then I just have like my shower stuff there on the sink. And then this is for washing fruit. That's for washing dishes. Some more random stuff. The toilet. Oh, and the water heater. Um, over here, I have a mirror. Some of the rooms don't have mirrors, but I feel lucky mine does. I have some letters from my friends hung up over here. Okay. Here's the bed over here. Um, all the rooms come with these water coolers. Over here, I've got some sticky notes. The green ones are Chinese terms. The blue ones are quotes. You know, things like Colorado, Denver, stuff like that. Um, I recently have been doing more like trying to do artistic calligraphy because I'm in a calligraphy class, but we just sort of do row exercises. So, you know, moving up in the world. Oh, also, I did this during a class when I was supposed to be paying attention and I really like it. Okay, so here's the rest of the room. I'm on an actual side table. I got this lamp from Walmart and mm, I put up over the couch. So all the rooms have these couches and tables and they're pretty nice. Some of them are a little more beat up than this, but generally pretty good. Um, I put this up, I went to the printing office here on campus and they just printed these out like no joke in an inkjet printer. Uh, it took them like three hours and it was really cheap, but I felt pretty bad about it. Um, so I would not recommend that method, but this is just for the days when the sky is really gray. I have, yeah, some pictures I've taken of blue skies. Anyway, um, and then we'll skip the window for now because that's my favorite. This is my desk. I put all my calligraphy stuff down there. Um, I have like books and stuff, obviously. All of these books are from the office because past students have just left them and so you can borrow them, um, which is nice. It's hard to find English books here. Um, printer paper, some more calligraphy. Um, I got these pens, that's how I've done a lot of like the mountain scene and the sky so blue thing. I was just using these dudes, they're kind of great, they were like two bucks. Um, one drawer has <laughs> a lot of ones. Uh, I used to get these for the bus, but then I got a bus card and WeChat Pay, so I haven't needed them. And then, yeah, my scissors and stuff. This is where the TV used to be, but I've been using it for food. Um, I got the water boiler at the office uh, for free. Someone had left it behind. Um, I found peanut butter at Walmart, which has been great. I make peanut butter sandwiches most mornings. And then I got some tea, some chopsticks. I brought a spork, but like, I don't think I've ever once used it because I just use chopsticks for everything. I was worried since I'd never used chopsticks before, but it turns out you adapt, you know? Um, and then I have some pictures that I brought from home of some friends. Me and some of the girls I met here, who are now some of my really good friends, made a bucket list at the beginning of the year. Uh, we still got a lot to mark, mark off. Uh, it feels like we've done so much, but there's still a lot to go. So this is my favorite part of the room, the window. It's basically like a balcony window hybrid, window seat thing. So I got this at Walmart for like, probably it was like six USD. Um, I got these plants also at Walmart. They're like, they're real because parts of them have died, but I am terrible at watering them and they're still kicking, so impressive. Um, and I mostly use this as a balcony, like I actually step up here. I water my plants by holding them out over here so the water doesn't drip in my room. And I think I've watered some clothes sometimes on accident, but you know. 
and this is my view. Um, today's a pretty average day. It usually is about this gray. Downtown is over there and kind of like going back behind it as well. Uh, and then the Tibetan district is this street right here. Gosh, it's so beautiful. It's some really good food and shops down there. It's honestly so, so great. Yeah, this is a really cool location. Uh, the window has like this real window closes and then it's also got screen. When I leave my room, I close the screen, but the only times I ever close a window is if I'm leaving for more than like two days. Because uh, rain like doesn't come in, so that's nice. Um, yeah. Alright, so that is my room in Chengdu, China. Um, I hope that was helpful. If you are coming to this program specifically and have questions, let me know. Um, and if you have any questions about studying abroad, um, yeah, also let me know. I watch a lot of YouTube, so I'll see if you guys have left comments, even though I'm not on this channel very much. Um, Alright, that's it. Adios.